Hey, so for the past three weeks I have made several videos and none of them have ended up on the internet. That's probably because I started school again and I'm a little bit busier, but also because once I started editing them I just wasn't really happy with them, so... So hopefully this one will actually end up on the internet. So I spent this last weekend in Seattle with two of my really close friends and I had a really awesome time. We stayed at a hostel that is called the Green Tortoise Hostel and it was right by Pike's Market and it was like right by as in right across the street. Uh, it was super nice. It's a good area to be in because it's easy to get to kind of a lot of the main places that, I don't know, we were interested in going to. The only kind of negative part of the trip uh, was that last night we were supposed to get in just after 8 o'clock and we didn't get in until almost 11.30 and that's a long time. We sat at the border for just over three hours which is insane and for like an hour and a half of that I swear we didn't even move 10 feet and the three of us just slowly kind of descended into madness because it was just... couldn't handle it. Couldn't handle all the waiting. Other than that, it was a really great time and I really enjoyed it. I would definitely go back and stay at the same place because it was really nice. If any of you guys are on Instagram, you can look at all of our photos from the trip by searching up the hashtag Dunch Take Seattle. Yep. In the last two videos that I didn't upload, I kind of talked about um, some interesting things, I guess, that have happened to me over the past few weeks. For example, I was attacked by a crow, I was going out to go for a run, and I had my hair up in a ponytail, and this crow swooped down and grabbed the back of my ponytail with its claws, and then like flew off away. But it had me for a second. Ugh. It was scary, it was weird, it was really kind of like freaky. And then the other really randomly weird thing is that I woke up to these really weird noises outside of my window, and I couldn't figure out what it was, but I knew that there had been raccoons in the trees in our backyard the day before, so I have this big tree in front of my window, so I thought maybe there were raccoons out there, so I like opened up the blinds, looked out, looked up at the tree, and I couldn't see anything, so I didn't know what was happening. And then like a half an hour later, I got a phone call from my dad saying that the school across the street from my house had called him, saying that there were two raccoons having sex basically at underneath this tree right outside of my window. So I go back and look and sure enough there's two raccoons going at it at the base of this tree right outside my bedroom window. And um, because I live in front of a school, there was also like a lineup of students like, oh my god, look! What's happening over there? So that's the weirdness in my life. School is going really good for me. I'm really liking both of the classes that I'm taking. It's stuff that I think is definitely important to teach to students, so I'm glad that I'm learning it so that I can actually, um, I don't know, teach kids stuff, whatever. But yeah, I don't really know what else to say, so... Got a midterm in two days, so I should be studying, which is probably why I'm filming instead. So I better go. Um, hopefully I don't completely stop making videos throughout the duration of this school semester, but we'll see. I hope you're having a wonderful day, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!